Hi church, this is Pastor Christy. I would like to read for you a passage of scripture from Hebrews chapter 6 verses 17 through 20. Because God wanted to make the unchanging nature of his purpose very clear to the heirs of what was promised, he confirmed it with an oath. God did this so that by two unchangeable things in which it is impossible for God to lie, we who have fled to take hold of the hope set before us may be greatly encouraged. We have this hope as an anchor for the soul, firm and secure. It enters the inner sanctuary behind the curtain where our forerunner Jesus has entered on our behalf. He has become a high priest forever in the order of Melchizedek, the word of the Lord. Friends, we have this hope in Jesus. When we called him into our hearts and asked for forgiveness of our sins and repented, and he accepted us as a brother or sister, We have been anchored since then. And an anchor is a wonderful metaphor for right now in these unprecedented times. We need an anchor and Jesus is our anchor. We have the promise of eternal salvation which gives us hope and that hope is our anchor where we can hang our hat every day so I would just like to um, share with you a few thoughts about that we are right now at the six month mark of these unprecedented times and I'm not sure how long they're gonna go but I still hear of people talking about getting back to normal well friends I would like to encourage you that you reframe your normal and that normal should be wherever you go holding Jesus hand every morning when you get out of bed that should be normal whatever it takes you through the day that should be normal and if you have opportunity to participate in an event or to visit with someone or to chat online or to somehow do your work whatever you're called to be doing that will be your normal and for now we need to hang on to Jesus as our normal and I so encourage you to do that that if we reframe our normal we're better equipped to handle whatever changes today brings so if we reframe our normal to be holding Jesus hand when the minute we wake up in the morning and when until we go to bed at night knowing that he's going to be with us even then the changes will be easier because I know at least at my work, sometimes there's changes to several times a day. Sometimes there's only one or two for a week, but I never know what normal is gonna be anymore. And I have a feeling a lot of you are in the same position. We don't know what normal is because we're comparing normal to the old way we used to have. And so if we reframe our normal, to be hanging on to and hanging out with Jesus, then we're going to be anchored for whatever the changes are. And friends, I just encourage you to be anchored to Jesus. You won't drift far, not if you hold fast to your anchor. May God bless you and keep you. May his face shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace. Amen.